how to fix Minecraft connection lost internal exception colon java.lang dot stack overflow error. Now if your Minecraft server is getting this error then you are running your Minecraft server with too much RAM and the local device or server host cannot support that amount of RAM. So within your Minecraft command you're going to need to change the amount of memory your server uses. So the first thing we need to do is disconnect from our game so I'm going to do that right now. I'm in my Minecraft world here so I'm just going to press escape and I'm going to hit disconnect. Once you're disconnected from your Minecraft world, the next thing you need to do is open up your terminal and stop your server. So I'm just going to type stop and then hit enter and our server will stop and the terminal window will automatically close once our Minecraft server has stopped. So I'm just going to minimize now out of the Minecraft client and I'm going to X out of this image. I'm currently hosting the Minecraft server on my local PC here. Therefore, all the files for my Minecraft server are currently on my desktop and I'm using Windows. Now, if you're running your server on a server host, then what you'll need to do is to connect via SSH and then adjust the server RAM within that command. So if you're also hosting your server on your local device, what you'll need to do is find the server contents. As you can see, it's on my desktop here in a folder called Minecraft. So I'm just going to double click on this here. Once you've found the server files, locate the batch file that contains the command. So as you can see, the Windows batch file is right here. It's called Minecraft run command. So what I'm going to do here is right click on the batch file and then left click on edit. Once you've done that, you'll be able to see the contents of the batch file. As you can see, currently I'm running the Minecraft server with 1.5 gigabytes of RAM or 1,500 megabytes. Now, because we're getting that error that I showed you at the start, I'm going to need to change the amount of RAM the server utilizes. By default, the Minecraft server run command Command runs your server with 1024 megabytes or one gigabyte. So what I'm going to do is change this 1500 megabytes for the XMX and XMS to 1024. So I'm going to quickly do that now. So I'm just going to delete 1500 here and then change it to 1024 and then do the same here. Once you've done that, left click on file here and left click on save to save the Minecraft run server command. All I need to do now is X out of the batch file here and double click on the batch file that you have just newly edited to restart your server. Now all we need to do is wait for our Minecraft server to start running once again. So I'll be back with you once the Minecraft server is running again. And there we go guys, our Minecraft server is now running again. So I'm just going to open up the Minecraft client here. Once you've got that open, all I'm going to hit is direct connection here. And then because I'm running my server on my local PC here, the server address is just going to be a zero. And then all I'm going to do is left click on join server and it should take us into our Minecraft world. All right, guys, with that little RAM adjustment to your Minecraft server start command, you will not be getting that error again. All right, guys, that pretty much concludes the video. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, be sure to give this video a like, comment down below, and most importantly of all, subscribe to support the channel. I'll see you on the next video.